Here I'll show you a few tips on making your engineering drawings. As you can see here, I have an engineering drawing of this basic crank shown in this isometric here. Here's the drawings, and the first thing I'm going to look for is to make sure it's in third angle. So I'll right click on Sheet, Properties. You can see it's in first angle. I want it to be in third angle. Select that, press OK. Now this is updated. The next thing I'll look at is this view here. As you can see, this has hidden lines visible as I want it. However, it's showing these tangent lines here and here that I don't want to see. So I'll right click on that view. Tangent edge. It has tangent edges visible. I want those removed. Now I want to put in some dimensions. So I'll take the Smart Dimension tool. The distance between these two holes is very important. So I'll select one hole, select the other one. There's that dimension. Now I want the overall length. That's what's measurable. I'll select this arc, select this arc. Now you can see when I selected these two arcs, it put the dimension as going from the midpoint of those two arcs. That's not what I want here. I'll delete that. Select Smart Dimension. Now I'll right click on this arc and I'm going to select the midpoint, which is at the top of the arc. Now I'll right click on this other arc, select midpoint, which is at the bottom, and now I get the dimension that I want. It's asking to make this driven. Yes, I want this driven by the geometry in the model. I don't want to be able to change the model based on the engineering drawing. Now I can change some options. I can go to Tools, Options, Document Properties, and Units. I can select Inches, press OK. Now my dimensions are showing in inches. I'll go put in another dimension. Select the d diameter of this hole. Say I wanted to put a note on this. Say the hole is tapped, for example. I can go into dimension text here and add a note. Say I wanted to put a special tolerance on this dimension too. And tolerance precision. I can go into this menu, choose symmetric, and I can choose a narrow tolerance. And that now shows in the engineering drawing.